Yes or no, this room? <laughs> this room? Yeah, Matt said this room. This, this room? <laughs> this room. So guys, we're on our way back to our first ever location that me and Adam shot for Ghost Trip Investigation. Can I ask you a question? Yeah? Is this one oldie woldy? <laughs> <laughs> this one is very oldie woldy, guys. <laughs> New drinking game for Ghost Trip Investigation. Oldie woldy. Every time Stan says oldie woldy, you drink. And every time I say bosh, you drink. <laughs> bosh! Oldie woldy. <laughs> so we're going back to the, um, the Norwich Lunatic Asylum. It is abandoned, obviously. Uh, it won't be when me and Adam are in there though, they'll have a couple of residents back. Yeah. It's been abandoned since the late 1990s, so it's coming up to a good 30 years now that it's uh, well, over that now, isn't it? We have done an investigation here a few months back now, isn't it? Yeah. Got some That's really good results. First one we ever done together, first, wasn't it? Yeah, first one. Um, and we've been itching to come back ever since. And so, you um, guys have been asking us to come You guys back have been asking well. us, so here we are, guys. But yeah, this is, this is the... You guys didn't get to see this last time because we was here during uh, the night, so you're kind of getting a access all areas kind of feel to the building today. Bit of a different vibe in the day. It is a different vibe. It is a different vibe during the day. Yeah, there it is. Hi guys. Welcome. We're back. We're back. We're back. Uh, I'm Adam. I'm Dan. And this is Ghost Trip Investigation. That was like well energized. It was very energized. Was very energized, wasn't it? Um, today we are in a very special place. This is our place. We did our very first ever paranormal investigation Ooh. together. 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 Do, 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 what was that song? Do, 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 do. It's back together, together. together. I want to show you. Yeah. yeah, we won't make it onto Pop Idol. No, Pop Idol was like 2010. How old are you? Old. <laughs> X Factor. That's yeah, the one. X Factor. Yeah. Um, today we are in. We've just done that bit. <laughs> Have we? No, we haven't. We're in Norwich. Fucking <laughs> <Okay, now>, hell. <laughs> seriously, look what I'm working with. Um, Never work with kids or animals. Yeah. We're at Norwich. Norwich! Lunatic Asylum. Little fun fact about Norwich. Has the best... Don't talk about football. Has the best football team in the whole world. And also, I live here! Anyway. <laughs> so when Frank Bruno had his little spell of um, issues, issues, this is where he stayed. This is where he's staying. He's not dead, so we're not going to be able to contact him. Unless he's still in there and couldn't find his way out, which I doubt very much. A lot of history though to this building. A lot of history. A lot of history to this building. It's been empty since about the early 1990s, 90s, so yeah. coming up 30 years. And it used to be massive. It used to go that way, that way, back to It's huge. What is left? Big old place. So we're going to head inside. We'll uh, give you a little look around and show you what equipment we're going to be using today. Let's go! Adam's going to... If I go near it, look. So Adam's near it, nothing. You actually physically, you have to touch it. You physically have to touch that. And there's no wind or anything coming back. Pulled it up. It's pulled it up. Pulled it up. That was extremely, extremely. But do you know what's really compelling about it? Is if, it's, if it's wind, this indicates where it's been touched. So if I then touch this side, look. Ah, it tells you where it's been it's touched. Tells you where guys. it's being touched. How many spirits are there with us? That's right, a that's a upstairs, and it's upstairs. So get out. Is there, is there somebody upstairs? Is there somebody upstairs? That's a little girl then. Mm. Are we, have, we got any, have we got any children with us today? You need to put your speaker. Adam.
Do you remember us from last time? What was that? That was a clear man's voice. If there is a spirit still in the room with us, can you make yourself known by coming forward and touching the bear? Use our energy, our phone's energy, torch's energy. No. No. It's a child as well. No. Little child went, no. Did you hear that? Yeah. She went, no. It's almost like a no. Yeah. And we can get those out for you. It's better with the speaker. You can hear things we haven't heard before. Can you tell us your name? Shit! Guys, did you hear that? And it was a child as well, and it was a name. We're, we're gonna trying have to, to listen to you. We're gonna have to play that back. Girl. That was definitely a real clear little girl's voice. The little girl that you were just speaking to, could you come, and come through, come forward, and speak to, my name's Dan, and I'm my friend Adam and Ryan. Would you like to touch the bear again? It's, a, it's an amalgamation of sounds. If you hear a word come out of this, it has been manipulated. That child again. When... What's that? That's not like this How? If you hear words, they've been manipulated, guys. Okay? Hello? I thought there was somebody there. I did. Hello? Did you go? Did you hear that? I heard it, but I didn't catch it. Oh. Turning. Could, can you tell us your name? <clears throat> the little girl went, no. The little girl? The child, can you tell us your name, please? We aren't here to cause any harm. To the child spirit, you told us your name earlier and we didn't catch it very clearly. Can you tell us again? Adam. It's my name whispered then. Whisper. There's a lot of Adams coming through. They don't like you. Whisper. It actually said whisper. It was a woman went whisper. Would it be better if I whispered? Is that what you're telling me to do? Whisper? Is the child scared? Should I whisper? Was that mum? Was that a kid who went mum? Mm. This is to the child spirit. The child spirit. Could you touch the teddy bear again like you did earlier? Make it flash. Could you touch the teddy bear? It's in the windowsill. If you squeeze it, it'll make pretty colours. There, there she, she is. is. There she is. Just as we stop recording, you can hear a potential voice. Hello. What do you think Hello. it's trying to say? Can you do that again, we moved the REM pod and the EMF reader Thank away from you, the teddy, you. thinking oh, that you. was putting the child spirit off. On cue. Can you step away from it, please, so it goes off in three, two, one. Step away from it now, please. Oh, Thank you. my. Go Thank on. you so much, spirits. Really appreciate that. The image. Wow. Good luck staying with it. You have to touch this, guys. To make that go off, you physically have to touch it. Thank you, spirits. Now, could you do one step further for us? It won't harm you in any way, shape, or form. Throughout the investigation, a spirit or spirits would definitely touch in the bear. Now, this bear is a special bear, and it needs to be touch activated. And when it is touched. You can see on the can bear touch where it's touched. So if you touch it on the arm, yeah, you'll see the arm light up. The bear, if you touch it on the leg, you'll see the leg light up. It was tiny, it was like a little child. That's the little girl. It was there, straight away. Guys, away. did you see that? Sorry, I don't. Spirit, could you do it one last time? Could you show us as a figure on here so we can say hello to you? Could you do that again once more for us? It's gone, look. It, oh, she's left. She's still there. Can we see you as a figure again, those spirits, please? 
That's a little child. Look how small it Thank is. Thank you, sweetheart. There are a lot of satanic worship points, devil signs. We all know that 666 represents the devil um, and all things that are unholy. On this pentagram, with, which has got 666 into it, okay, with the eye, there's this picture. Okay. Thanks for the gifts, guys. Uh, there is a picture here. When we did a bit of research, we always do a little bit of research before we go to a new property, new venue, do an investigation. Um, this man actually came up on Google image search. This man used to work here. His name is George. This man's name is George. If you hear the word George come through tonight, it's most likely this man here. He wasn't a patient or an inmate, okay? Holding people hostage spirits hostage in this property, not letting them leave. There's an orb just then, a couple of orbs, yeah. Really? And they might be dust, burning. Yeah, no, the thorns come out of your head, aren't they? Really? Yeah. Yeah. The guys, are, the guys are filming and they've seen orbs flying behind me. Spirits, can you manifest yourself in front of Adam as a ball of light? Yeah. Can you float? Yeah. Thank you, spirit. One. Oh, uh, Adam. What was that? Thank you, Spirit, for talking to us. Guys, I've got a woman's voice then. What was that? Spirit, could you, ma could you manifest yourself again in front of Adam as a ball of light? Can you see the amount of yeah. Adam? Can that female talk to us again, please? Just a little bit away. Uh, we need to see Adam. Up the one on this side. Can that woman say something again? I think the people of I are like shining off of dust because. Thank you, spirits. We can see a lot of you here um, as orbs, as balls of light. Could you hover in front of Adam's face? Could you just stand or hover as a ball of light in front of Adam so we can see you? Set a tap, apparently. We encourage you to use our energy, our phone's energy, our torch energy. Do you like the bear? Wow, uh, there we go, guys. Thank you, that's a new part of the bear. A new part of the bear, so the other side of the... This bear is only activated by touch. It's not the other one anymore, it's touching the middle. Thank you, spirits. Thank you. That was on cue. That was on cue. That was on cue, guys. Guys, and just to let you know, we're on a concrete floor, so look, us, it's rock hard. It's rock. We're not even on a wooden floor. Okay. Spirit, can you move away from the bear? Thank you. Thank on you. And again. It's a... That's a woman's voice. Yeah. yeah. I just like had a, to stop. Like a, uh, a cry. Yeah. That was a cry. We just heard a cry when I was about to stop. Like, please do touch that teddy bear up on the windowsill if you are still here with us. We invite you to come forward. We invite you to interact with us, the teddy bear using any energy you deem necessary, including ourselves. There's an orb then as well. That was a little girl. Well, it said the same thing three times. Dog. Dog. It said dog. the same thing three times. It said dog. If the child spirit I've got absolutely freezing, I don't know if this wind can come through here, but I'm really cold. Really cold. It's, 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 can you, is somebody making me very cold? Is there somebody making me cold? I'm move the bed on the floor now. If you are in the room with us, could you please show your here by touching the teddy bear that is on the floor in moving, front of us, please? Are you moving keys? No. Did you, did you hear that? Did you hear juggling keys? Yeah. Who was in the bed though? It's funny you said honestly, there's been like... Well, I thought it might have been the dog walk, but he's, he's gone now. It was that. I hear chains. Saying that, I yeah, that's weird. I thought I thought it was Adam playing with keys. I'm going to ask a question again. Can you tell us who the, 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 the prominent spirit is that we're going to be speaking with tonight? Come forward. Hmm. What is your name? What's your name? Ghost. <laughs> Said ghost. Guys, I'm freezing. Yeah. Yeah, it's so cold in this room. It's freezing in this room. 
We oh. also have a sorry. We also have a cat ball or a small green ball. If you move that or touch the bear, they will go red. Thank, Thank you. you so so much. That was on fucking cue. Wow. Oh, got something on. These cat balls are very hard to activate, and again, they do need to be touched with some force. After this happened, we did pick up a figure wow. using our SLS Thank you. device, Thank you for that but we cat didn't ball. manage to get it on camera. What is the name of the man on the wall? Can you say it more clearly? There's someone, there's someone out. Come forward, come through. Put the torch in front of you, Dan. Come forward, use our energy. Use the torch's energy. Use the phone's energy. Use the camera energy. What's the name of the man on the wall? Another voice. Another voice. What room are we still in? Can you show yourself as a, as a, as a stick figure on my camera? Can you come round and film? Can you show yourself as a... Like, guys, that's the teddy bear it's picking up at the moment, okay? That's the teddy bear, guys, that it's picking up. It's not paranormal. Can you show yourself as a stick figure on my screen? I know it takes a lot of energy, Spirit. Can you show yourself? We moved down to the old fireplace, Something as we had a lot of activity the last time that we were here. Ryan, was that you, Spirit? Yeah, we turn the word bank on and, well, listen for yourselves. Spirit, can you show yourself? Can you tell us where we are, Spirit? Do not. Do not. You, you, do, not, what, you do not know where we are? Or you do not want to tell us? Emma. Emma? So nearly. Is it definitely Emma that you mean? So nearly. <laughs> so Help me. Help me. I don't, I think it's... Yes. yes. Goodbye. Gone straight away, goodbye. I, I think... Gone very cold. That was not Emma. I think there's a letter missing off the beginning of that. Mm-hmm. Help me, it said as well. Yeah. How can we help you? Quiet. Okay. Goodbye. Oh. Is that so be Blood. Soon as I... Annoying. Blood. Annoying. Yeah, as soon true. as I started talking, it's I a... feel like there's two here. I feel like she's talking, and I think yeah. there's another one telling her to maybe shut up because we're anno or we're annoying. Yeah. Drip. Drip. Do not. Grandfather. Yeah, see, I feel like there's two here having like a bit of a ding dong. Blacksmith. Blacksmith. Blood. Blood again. again. Demon. Demon. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> oh, of course. Down. Down. Devil. Yeah. What's his name, though? What is his name? There's a noise just here. We're unsure what it is, and it wasn't Ryan, but it does sound like a small groan. That was just do, 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 do. Yeah, I heard it. I heard it. Hello. 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 What's your name? Can you tell us your name? Oh, bang it. No, I thought I heard a voice saying, 
really distant whisper. Cat. 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 If you are with us, if you are here, we invite you to use our energy. Can you touch the green... Eugene. Eugene? Old name. Can you touch the green ball and make it go red? A black, someone just pointed out, a blacksmith would use a hammer. Correct. Cat balls. Cat. Yeah, cat that's what ball. I was going to ask. Can you touch the cat ball for us? Can you make, if you touch it, I've gone really cold. If you touch it, it will go red. Flames. In Flames. fire. In Australia. Australia? I don't know where that comes in. Cat in the flames. Cat in the flames. A cat ball in the fireplace. Cat ball in oh, the fireplace. That's... Cat in the flames. Emily. Emily. Cat ball in the fireplace is what they're trying to say. Yeah. Can you touch? What did that say? Blacksmith. Blacksmith again. Can you touch the cat ball that is in the fireplace? Can you touch me? Can you grab be me? Be careful. We, we shall be careful. What have we got to be careful of? What do we need to be careful of? Hell. <sighs> Dog. Bobby. Hell. Dog. Was that a bird? Bobby. Bobby. Heart attack. Go on. Gun. Certain Mr. B has a Car. more prominent nickname. Mr. B, who's Mr. B? You know who Mr. B oh, is. Oh, yeah. His nickname for the less. Oh. Yeah. Make a noise. Do something. Come on. Tell us. Tell us you're here. Show us you're here. Use all the energy you can. Use everything you've got and all of... Use all of our energy, your body. We'll use all our energy. Touch that cat ball in the fireplace. Make it go red. Come on. You've done it once. You've touched the bear once. Do it again. Do it again. Use our energy to do it. Or we're going we're gonna to move. We're going to turn this off. Brand new cat balls. Adam, then. as well. If you'd like us to stop in a particular room, shout stop. It went stop straight away. Yeah, that was stop. It went stop. Stop. Away. Stop. Stop. Stop straight away. Three people said stop. I don't know. This is the room that we've been in loads, so I don't want to go back in there just yet. Okay, so we've just left the asylum just for a couple of moments. We are going to head over to the morgue. Uh, we've been there in the evening. We have not been there in the day. As we left the building to go to the morgue, Adam and Ryan heard the REM pod go off. So they decided to go back into the asylum to investigate and it went off again. So you've got Kit Kats, bits of the Twin Towers. <laughs> and then you've got beams on the end of his hand, I don't know what that means. Knob. Uh, <laughs> it just says my lady. Uh, it's got a pentagram here, this is some kind of demon. Got weird feet. Hail Satan. Yeah, it's got some weird feet. Oh, amazing. Got a top hat. Spirits, we're over at the morgue. We went over to the morgue and the vibe was just have, different. Have here? Dan actually gained access to the building and as soon as he did, he felt uneasy and just wanted to get out. Or well, can you tell me where I am? What did it say? Something, I think. You can put it on airplane right now. Oh. Can you? Kids. Tell us where we are, please, spirits. Eight. We're just going to be quiet and we're just going to let this speak. Hi, Darby Dan. Just going to let this speak. And crows just to add to the atmosphere, don't they? Go and sneeze. Bless you. <laughs> yes, that is the usual necrophonic. Els, thank you for the trophy. 
so I'm I'm stood in the morgue, guys. Uh, it, it's not. I've got a very eerie feeling in here. I don't like it at all. Uh, it feels totally different to when I was stood in the main asylum. There is a room through there with some weird sayings on the wall. There's a on the door there. It says, uh, "Do not open. Death inside." There's evidence of a seance that's happening here. Um, I just got. I just want to get out. If I'm honest. Yeah, get out. Then. We left a camera watching the REM pod. Now we are not sure if this is a bird, but it certainly doesn't sound normal. We've got some candles here, guys, okay? Uh, which we're gonna put into a circle. We're gonna light them. Uh, we're gonna see how it reacts to flame rather than artificial light, okay? Because a lot of people know that things will react better to a flame rather than artificial light. So we're going to create a circle, we're going to take your turns to stand in that circle and we're actually going to ask if any spirits can physically affect us. Emotionally, physically, touching us on the back of the head, leg, chest, shoulder, wherever. Or sometimes an energy, a, a, a spirit can change your energy. What I mean by change your energy, they can make you feel emotional, they can make you feel elated, happy, sad, extremely down and depressed. They can give you a complete mix of emotions. Um, heat, cold. So we're gonna, we're gonna do the circle of candles, we're gonna take it in turns to stand in that circle, we're gonna probably put the spirit box on and see if we can be affected either physically, as I say, or emotionally um, by a spirit or entity. Are there any spirits here now that wish to come and talk to us? Use our energy to move this planned chair. Use my energy, the camera energy, the light source energy, the candles. We invite you to interact with us, the board. Can you tell us your name? Use our energy, spirit. Use all of our energy. Was that knocking? Yeah. Yeah, did you hear that knocking, guys? Yeah. It does take a while to get going, guys. He is moving, mate. Yeah. It's very really slight, it's moving. It's like he's keep pushing it. Do we have a child spirit trying to communicate with us on the board? If you're a child spirit, if you can't read, oh, I'm getting some weird sensations through my finger. I've never had that before. There's a sun on the board and a moon on the board pictures. If you're a child spirit, the yes is a sun and the moon is a no. So if you are a child spirit, you can tell us by saying, going on the, the sunshine. If you're not, then obviously you don't need me to tell you that there's sun and a moon you can read. We started the Ouija in a room that had the most activity, but in the end decided to move to a different location. When energy builds and there's something there, you can just tell the you difference. Can tell, yeah. It's really hard to explain it, <laughs> and you guys will get to experience this when we when we do the event side of stuff. Um, oh. Yes, you are safe to watch. Is that a new YouTube movement then? No, not me. Mm. Try a different room. The George room. This is the, this is the room we've had most of the activity in there today. What was the room that we went in when everybody started bloody talking to us? Coming off the board. There was that one room. Not yeah, the room. Now it's a few up, it's cold, we had all the voices. And yeah, yeah well, as soon as we walked in there with an F, it was like, let's just give it another couple of more minutes. Please use our energy to come and speak to us. We invite you to speak to us. Ooh. 
our first that's move. That's better, that's better. Come on. Use our energy. Use our energy, guys. Please use all of our energy. We give you permission to use our energy. You can drain us. You. Can you, can you tell us the names? Whilst in the next room and asking the spirits to use the available energy, our camera mic started making static sounds, a sign of energy being used. Use our energy. Use our energy, spirit. Can you tell us your name? Our energy spirit. Communicate with us through oh. the board. Use our energy. Huge pins and needles in my legs. Yeah. In my feet. Is like somebody that. affecting Adam? Is there somebody affecting Adam? Can you let us know? Oh, I think if we give it to guys as well. Honestly, like massive pins and needles. Guys, all the gifts help us do more venues. So thank you for all the gifts. It is much appreciated. Just join some more energy on this board. Yeah. yeah. We're gonna we're gonna move this is us music. This is us guys, get some energy on the board. See we're feeling very dead in this in this in here today. Spirits, please use our energy, the camera energy and the torch energy to keep you again. I think you're feeling a you guys. Is that a you spirit? You, is there any other letters you would like to tell us? Not make, is this a child spirit we're speaking to? Operations back. Yeah. Is, that still near? is this a child spirit we're speaking to? This is a child spirit, you're not sure on spelling. There is a great big sunshine up in the corner. If it, If we're a GP? Are you asking us if we're a GP or are you, are you a GP? Will you adopt to here? It is safe to watch guys yet. You're not going to get any repercussions. Did you used to work here? Or were you a patient here? Were you a patient here? Use our energy. The Ouija session felt weird. We had some energy on the board, then we didn't, then we did. Then we didn't, and it kept repeating in a cycle. Can you tell us your name, Spirit? Can you tell us your name? Have you gone? To it. We're going to say goodbye, Spirit. We're going to say goodbye to board. you. Goodbye. We're going to get some energy and we're going to invite somebody else onto the board. Turn the comments on. Okay, Spirit. If there is anybody there that would wish to communicate with us, please use our energy. This torch is energy. Get the neck off of it. Thank you for the X. But... Spirits, we're going to get some energy on this board again. Mike. Use our energy spirits. Come and take this energy. Use the torch's energy. Are there any spirits that wish to come and communicate with us on the board? It's me moving it guys. I've got my fingers trying to hold a steady left in the cockpit. Not powering. Who's that? Did you just ask us who he was? Yeah. Yeah. 
I'm Adam. My name is Dan. We mean you no harm. Please come and interact with us. I. Thank you, Spirit. Use our energy. Thank you. Use the phone energy, the torch energy. Is this the child spirit? Don't acknowledge him. Is there a prominent spirit here that we can speak to? Guys, we made it back to the hotel. It's been a really long day filming. We've been filming for 12 hours. Thank you so much to everybody that has tuned in and watched us. We had incredible numbers, over 100,000 unique viewers. That Fantastic. is insane. Yeah. And just honestly, wanna, thank you so, yeah. so much. Just want to thank everybody. Usually uh, we have a nice long outro, but I don't know about you, I am shattered. <laughs> exhausted. Absolutely, Absolutely exhausted. Shattered. But, but, we have another investigation coming for you. We've actually already done the investigation. We have indeed. Hence why this was 12 hours. We've done Ish two. part two, yeah. but not really part two. See them all in the next part of the investigation. <laughs> what? <laughs> do it again. Just do it again. So tune in again in two weeks time. I'm laughing. Just wait. <laughs> Just wait, ready? Go. Fine. So tune in again in two weeks time where we have the next part of the investigation. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Guys, we've just made it back to the hotel. Thank you, sir. I, I'm looking at so make sure you're watching again in two weeks time where myself and Dan will be back with more spooky goings on. <laughs> Fucking hell, Adam. <laughs>